Alright, so what is up everybody, it's Moonbase12, where I got you guys the brand new video, and as you guys can see by the title, Jeffrey Lurie did it, he fired Chip Kelly, it was like what, like an hour ago or something like that, he fired Chip Kelly, so I was just going to the internet and all of a sudden I see Eagles head coach Chip Kelly released, I am beyond words, I am so happy, uh, finally, this guy is out of here. Skedaddle, go kick rocks, bro. We don't need you here. We don't need you in Philly. Chip Kelly fired by the Eagles. You heard it here. Jeffrey Lurie released a statement. I'm not going to read the whole letter for you guys. Uh, I'll probably link that down below in the description. But basically, Pat Shermer will be the interim head coach for one game against the Giants. And I can't wait for that game now. That game was a meaningless game. I was just like, oh, man, here we go. The offseason, full of rumors, full of other crap. Trip Kelly's going to come back, yada, yada. But no, we're going to see a traditional NFL offense being run for the first time in, what, like three years here in Philly? We're actually going to see them huddle up. We're actually going to see them... <laughs> we're actually going to see them have a good time in possession. We're going to see the defense get enough rest. We're going to see Murray running out of, uh, out of the I formation. It's, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. Oh, my God. I am oh I am thrilled. I am thrilled. Ed Marinowitz, the vice president of player personnel, he's fired, too. That was Chip Kelly's guy that he uh, brought up from in-house. And he and Chip basically just went to town, free agency, picked up all these crazy off-season moves. And a lot of people were saying, okay, if you're not going to fire Chip, at least get a new GM, somebody who knows how to say no. And Jeffrey Lurie, he gave us the best of both worlds. He fired the GM and, well, Chip Kelly was GM, but Ed Marinowitz was also part-time GM along with Chip. So we fired Ed Marinowitz and Chip Kelly. See ya. You can go be in Tennessee with your golden boy, Chip. Um, so now, so now here comes the rumors where uh, you can see in the background they're discussing it on NFL Network. Now, here comes the rumors about who are we going to get as the next head coach. And um, I'm pretty sure, not pretty sure, but just a couple thoughts in my head. I heard this on the radio. A guy said he wanted John Gruden. He said he might be able to come back. I don't know about that. Um, oh, I don't know what the defensive coordinator for the, um, for the Arizona Cardinals or something. I think he's going to be available. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm probably going to make a video on that with uh, Eagles Fan for Life 98 on their live stream next week. Or not next week, two weeks from now. Um, but yeah, now here comes the coaching situation. And the Eagles might be on hard knocks. I don't, I'm, I don't know how I feel about that. But there might be on high, hard knocks uh, this upcoming offseason because they haven't made the playoffs in the past couple of years. So, oh man, I'm so happy. I'm so Chip Kelly fired from the Eagles. Jeffrey Lurie putting down the hammer. He said that over this past three seasons, he's been evaluating Chip's progress. Season one, we got to the playoffs, didn't do anything. Season two, didn't get to the playoffs. And this season, we're not going to the playoffs. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? This is Philly, man. We've waited, what, like 55 years? We still don't have a Super Bowl title? 55 years since the championship? We're starting to grow impatient. Jeffrey Lurie, he saw, he, Jeffrey Lurie is a Boston guy. He wanted to buy the Patriots, but he couldn't. Robert Kraft outbid him, so he went down here to Philly. He sees what his, what his contemporaries are doing up there in New England. Building a champion. He sees what other owners are doing out there in Seattle, in Arizona. They're building champions. And it's either you, you stay mediocre or you, you innovate, you go ahead, you fire the, the, the head coach who doesn't, doesn't want to change, doesn't want to conform to the NFL level. So, it is what it is. But, this has been all guys. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Remember to like my Facebook page for a whole bunch of copyright videos and all that other stuff. Movies 12, like, right, comment, subscribe. I'm out. Peace.